Thank you. Thank you, everyone. I really appreciate you all support. Thank you. Now then, before I start my speech, I want to say something first. First off, I just wanted to congratulate on the big audience I have watching me here today on stage, but also, to the people watching this video, thank you for tuning in. It's not easy having a fan base here on YouTube, to have people watching this premiere, or video, so I appreciate those watching this video, my greatest appreciation for you all. Now then, let us resume with our speech. Now then, to the graduate class of 2024, whether if you completed high school, undergrad, or graduate's degree, I want to say something to you all. Congratulations, you all did it and made three years battling with everything your teachers and professors put you through. I know it wasn't easy, especially for those who completed their undergrad and graduate's degree from college, dealing with the stress of loans and paperwork. Oh boy, that was something. But of course, I can't leave you high school graduates behind, because not only is this message put upon college students, this day is also to commemorate high school graduates, and for the high school graduates out there, I just want to say this, if you plan to seek high education, such as going to college, don't feel pressured to start right away. I know many of us who complete high school want to take a chance at college immediately, but that's not what must be done from you. There's a process that you got to go through, such as completing the FAFSA form, for people living in the United States. Other countries may have different setups to how college applications work and what not. The colleges in the United States can be expensive, especially if you're in private school. I'm not sure how other countries do it, and I know in some European countries, college is free for students. Kinda wish I went to Europe for higher education. But anyway, you want to be sure on what you want to do with your life before stepping into higher education. Take my major for instance. I wanted to be a film and television major, and I chose a school that goes in depth with what I plan to do for my life in the future. College isn't like grade school. Yes, you will have homework. And professors, at least some might be a little strict on when you can and can't do regarding the syllabus. The professors I had for the most part in college, were quite nice and helpful. In fact I did better with grades in college than I had in high school. College or going to a university prepares you for the real world. And if you have an idea on what you want to do with your life, I say try seeking for higher education. But if you feel like you want to unwind a bit, but still have a consideration of going to college, then you can do that. College has no age limit. You can start whenever you want, and finish whenever you want. As an adult, only you can make that decision on whether or not you decide to go into college. As for me, I chose to go to college, because I have an idea of what I want to do with my life. And now that I'm a college graduate, I can potentially work in the film or TV field. So yeah guys, no stress about going to college. You can choose to go into higher education. But if you don't want to, or want a break from all the work you've had in grade school, then you can decide to pursue in higher education in the future. Either way, I believe college can help you. But don't take my word for it, I still go around looking for jobs, and the good thing about college is, if you're looking to build out your resume, you can have a one-on-one -on -one with college counselors, to have them discuss the next plan for your life. In college, you also build experience, and with that experience it helps you build your resume, so that others can hire you for those experiences you put on your resume, as tedious as it may be to apply and apply, but getting no answers. You just got to keep pushing yourself, but also surround yourself with others in your field so you get an option. That's what I'm trying to do, at least. But yeah guys, it's totally up to you if you want to pursue in higher education. I remember being in your shoes, figuring out the same question if I should go to college right away, or take a gap year. Either way, I still went, and completed my degree, if I can have a chance in making it in this world. You all who graduated high school, also can too. It just takes a lot of time, effort, 
and motivation to communicate with others in your major. If you want people to hire you for the career path you chose, but yeah guys, don't think I'm pressuring you to go to a higher education. You guys are adults now, you all can make a decision for yourself at this point. What you do with your life goes based on your decision. I already made my mind up with what I wanted to do with my life. I hope to all the high school and college graduates out there can be successful too with their lives. And don't forget one thing. Have faith in God. It's known to make your lives easier, if you keep His name in your heart. Because if you let God plan out your life, you will be successful. Nothing is impossible when you put full trust in your faith in the one who created you into this world. Ask him and you shall receive. My faith in Christ has benefited me, for how I live my life. I'm not worried about anything, as long as Christ God is watching over me, which I believe he is, 24-7. So yeah, don't give up in your journey. Your life is only beginning. You have so much out there in the world you can do, but apart from all that, remember to seek the Lord, for He can turn your life around for the better. But only if you ask and seek Him with all your heart, mind and soul. Yeah guys, so anyway, I'm going to wrap up my graduation speech video. I hope I inspired you all a little, to never lose hope now that you are entiring into your adult life. And may God bless those who want to be successful in their lives. I pray that each and every one of you don't lose faith in the Creator who is capable of doing things right for you. Once again, congrats to the class of 2024, both college graduates and high school graduates. I hope you all get to live a successful journey in your lives. And may God bless you. And as always, this is Timonations 900, signing off.